in the Philippines. Well, three nights from now, we'll be celebrating perseverance, bravery, and holiday cheer at Roswell Park. It's almost time to light the tree of hope to celebrate all of the incredible stories and fights going on at the Cancer Center. Every year, the event brings us something new, and this year, the folks at Roswell say you can expect some treats from local businesses, including hot chocolate from Spot Coffee and Tim Bits and Cider from Tim Hortons. And the VP of the proceedings will be nine-year-old Mason, a young cancer survivor, who gets to be in the middle of it all. And that night, Mason gets to hit that button and he gets to light up the entire Tree of Hope and really showcase what the essence of the holidays is. The kids are fearless and the kids are excited and they, they do understand what they've gone through, but it's not something that, they, that stops them or they take the time to feel down for themselves. They're really out there having a good time and sharing again in the feeling of hope for everybody. It all starts at 430 on Friday and we'll be live there with stories leading up to the lighting itself all evening here on Channel 2. And the one other thing that the folks at Roswell say will be new this year, some milder weather for a change. Yeah, definitely yeah. on Friday when they're doing that. Actually, by about like 7 o'clock at night, mm -hmm. could see a few showers beginning to sneak oh. into the area. So you may need an umbrella okay. if you're heading out.